My favorite technique, honestly, is blending extensions. Anybody can put extensions in, but not everybody can blend the extensions perfectly to make it look like it is their own hair. Um, that's actually something that I'm teaching here this weekend is how to properly blend your extensions. So that would be my favorite uh, technique. My favorite technique for all colorists right now is using your hands. So I love to use my hands to emulsify color, emulsify lightener, and actually even do painting. So for me, it's turning the brush vertically, sometimes on a slight diagonal, just to keep soft sweeps so you get that real beautiful integration of the colors melting together. Because ultimately, when you're thinking about melting two colors, you're really creating a third color. So it's about what do these colors link like, and then how do those sweeps work together? My tip for building the social media following is be unique, be you, be create your own vibe within the social vibe, I guess. Yeah. Aside from being important to build a following, you need to build a following of the right people. Okay, that's number one. And I think you need to be very consistent with your content. That would be another tip that I have and take great pictures. Favorite hair technique is actually to apply uh, fashion shades, specifically reds, just like you would a balayage. So in the same pattern that you would put your highs and lows in a balayage, you think of it, your colors in the same way. So for instance, if I have a palette of red violet, red and red copper, my red copper is gonna be the brightest. So that's where I would put my highlights and the red violet is gonna be the deepest. So that's gonna go on the base and it's also gonna go as your depth. curling hair, but what I do is I use maybe three different iron sizes to create um, exaggerated, disrupted texture. So that is actually what I'm obsessed with right now. Um, use a quality, uh, quality products on your clients. Don't, don't be trying to shortchange and, and just buying the cheap stuff because you don't want to invest in yourself, invest in your, in your business. So make sure um, you get the right products for your clients, have them ready for any situation, um, and, and that's it.